NYC Barbershop Museum. I'd like to welcome you in. My name is Arthur Rubino. I'm a master barber, four generations. I grew up in a barbershop since from former Soviet Union. My father started collecting uh, vintage pieces from 1991. Anywhere we went, like to the flea markets or to any like uh, antique stores, he used to buy vintage pieces, small pieces. Each piece has a history. You don't know who's been cut by this razor or by the scissors. In 2003, I lost my father. And, uh, you know, those pieces became sentimental. I started collecting bigger pieces as far as the barber chairs, barber poles, signs, anything to do with the barbering industry. Some of the pieces, like the mirrors, uh, some of them from Egypt, one is from France, one is from Russia. The tools, brushes, the mugs from England, we have some rare collection from Ireland from Poland. And that's when I started having an idea that one day I'm gonna open up a barbershop museum to honor my father and to give respect to all the barbers in the world. Oh, well, nice little nice Each person that walks in, I wanted to have that wow. And so far I accomplished that. Everybody coming in, they, they go, wow, there's a lot of detail in this shop. Usually when I start, even it's my customer. I like to say hello to the hair. I wanted to, to bring to the people not that chop shop of a haircut. A lot of barbershops, they don't want to use scissors over comb. That's what I'm trying to bring back, that classical haircut. And then the razor cut. A lot of barbers forgetting how to use the, the, the razor. So we're doing the usual, sir? Yes. Please. First of all, when they come in here, we wash. That's number one. Number two, each customer gets individual comb. When we give the comb to go, we use individual blade for each neck shave. Then we do hot towel massage for the neck. Customers respect that. When you, you, you give time and effort. He blended me very well. Yeah, it looks really nice. I also educate at the NYC Barbershop Museum. We have three students as we speak. And this, since this is a non-profit organization, I don't charge nobody to, 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 to give them experience and to teach them. We give you a barbershop necklace. Whoa! I love what I do and I, I want people to be happy. I'm not doing this uh, for the money. I'm doing this because I love it.